They made this on Great British Baking Show once. I think that means we should buy it. Let's get it. We're back at Costco. We've got free money. I have in my hand our Costco executive membership reward gift certificate for being VIP members. How much money do you think we have to spend? Is it 50 bucks? Is it a hundred bucks? More. A hundred and fifty bucks? More. <laughs> <laughs> it's that time of year again. We get to go spend this on whatever we want inside Costco. Let's go! Straight off the bat, we have back to school stuff. I have been wanting these for so long. And I've reached my post-it note era. And I will now stop forgetting everything I need to do always. Okay, for all of you private school peeps and school uniform friends, I know for a fact that this is one of the best brands for school uniforms, French toast. I had to wear these in junior high. <laughs> at North Late in junior high, it could only be blue, white, or green tops and basically khaki bottoms. Did you wear French toast brand? No. Aeropostale is the only cool one, or Hollister. Wow. Dallin, you heard it here. Dallin was an Aeropostale boy. These are really cute with the details. It almost makes me want to change everything about my life, stop homeschooling my kids, and send them to a private school. We could use this for food vlogs. We could get another black stone. Yeah, we already have six or seven. We could get another grill. I didn't know it when I married Dallin, but apparently you need a smoker, a grill, a flat black top. This look familiar? Love this thing. We did a brand deal for this and now it's here. Probably because of us. Probably because of us is here at Costco now. Make sure to take that sticker off before you film anything with Ninja though. They don't like that sticker. Late summer is one of my least favorite times to be here because the plant section is lacking. These do not excite me. Ooh, cactuses. I've only ever killed cactuses that I've bought. I think it is too soon, personally, but there are Halloween costumes at Costco. Kind of a Costco doom snob. <laughs> James? James has already chosen this outfit. It's somewhere between pajamas and a pony costume. And she loves it so much. How much is this? Would this cost our whole, would this be our whole budget? Most of it, but it would be worth it. It's a Halloween nativity. But it's so cute. Look at Huey, Dewey, and Louie. They're my favorite characters. Are we gonna move anytime soon? If I've learned anything in our marriage, you never know the answer to that question. I just don't wanna buy it if we're gonna move soon. Okay, you it broke in. it. I'm just putting it in the cart. Who knows if we'll buy it. This is for Halloween. Give these away for Halloween. Oh. How? These are, this is 120 mini packs of Pokemon cards. That's freaking genius. Let's do it we're before they be, sell out. We're gonna, be, we're gonna be the coolest house on the street. And no candy, I hate candy. <laughs> I didn't know we were in holiday season at Costco, but apparently we are and I love it. Uh oh, I kind of just want to get this for James. I want her to have it, I want it. I would just like to state for any parents out there that these take more than five minutes. If you only read the first sentence of each paragraph like me, you can get it done in three minutes. There's our boy. Yeah, three? These cookies contain nutrients from vegetables. It has mushrooms and tomatoes in it. Mushroom cookies. Nice. <laughs> Once upon a time, Ashley bought this. How's it going? Do you still like it? I like it more than other things, and I've been drinking it. Okay. So. So far, so good. That's my review on that product. <laughs> I'm gonna try this. Oh my lucky stars. A dry shampoo you haven't tried yet. Ashley loves dry shampoo. Tomato soup. To make my tomato soup that uses this tomato soup. <laughs> Trust us, it tastes really good. The recipe's linked. <laughs> they made this on Great British Baking Show once. I think that means we should buy it. Let's get it. This is a quinoa macaroni currently being sold. So for gluten free. $7.99. Is it good or? It's not bad. Ashley makes a mean breakfast casserole with these in it. So now I have made it my life mission to never run out of bacon or bacon crumbles in our fridge. And the recipe's linked. Bunions. That's right, all milk and onion. <laughs> all milk and onion? Have you ever tried these? Yeah, like in high school. I just never have. It was always like the worst possible thing you could do health-wise in my brain. You've never had a Funyun? Well, do you like it? It'd be good on my funeral potatoes casserole. Ashley interprets everything through their lens of the dashleyskitchen.com now. Crush it up, mm -hmm. put butter on top of mm -hmm. it, then bake it. Mm -hmm. Raisin bran crunch. Dude, samples are on point today. Okay, this next sample is a health sample. I will drink it for the people. Mm. Proteiny. Crispy beef burrito tacos. Health. It's for the vlog. Okay, bye. You know what I've always wanted to try? What? This? It's just so intriguing. Look at it. 
Look at it. It looks like something from Avatar. I'll just tell the kids it's purple orange juice. Oh, this 4th of July, our lighters made me so mad. These are good ones, the torch flames. They don't blow out at the slightest wisp of wind. Now we can finally have fun as a family together. <laughs> finally. How lazy have we gotten? You toasted. How does the cheese not drip out while you're toasting it? We're probably gonna have to buy it. Maybe use it in an air fryer so it can lay flat. I love air fryers and support your use. Go on. Why would I get the air fryer <laughs> dirty if I can just put it in the toaster? Why get the toaster dirty no if you can one. put it in the air fryer? You can't dishwash a toaster. No I will defend air fryers to my death. Don't you get something to air fry like this nice Philly cheese steak? Okay? Those are not good. I've tried those. That is it. We are having an air fryer versus toaster grilled cheese competition oh when God. we get home. I am 100% sure that this will be the best thing I've ever tasted. Whoa, fish shaped waffle cake? Weird. Portuguese custard tarts. Holy cow. And look what I found. This is turning into a Costco dessert haul fast. I couldn't be happier. This is pretty. Nice and light for summer. I thought that Costco already peaked with their blankets last year. You know, we love that blanket. And then you go and do something like this. Well, I think it's a pretty color. And totally redeem yourself. All right, let's go home. We got some things to test. How much over $168 do you think this is? Um, well, depends on if we actually buy that or not. We don't have to. All right, welcome to the portion of the vlog called We Tested Out the Stuff from Costco So You Don't Have To. Ashley's got her toaster and she's got my air fryer. Wow, what a beautiful sight. The most beautiful appliance next to the most beautiful woman. Can we get some love for air fryers in the comments? Cause I'm not getting any over here. <laughs> Oh good, you cleaned it this time. The rules are very simple. We have a toaster and we have an air fryer and we have grilled cheese sandwiches that Costco has wrapped in plastic and put together for us. They recommend to do either a toaster or a microwave. Ew, microwave grilled cheese? Set the toaster to medium high. You guys, rumor has it that on toasters, these are minutes and not degrees of toastiness. It's the same degree no matter what. I don't know if that's true or not, but anyways, I'm guessing medium high is like four minutes? I don't know. You put yours in here, and I'm putting mine in here. What do you set it to? I don't see a grilled set it cheese to option. Or egg. Let's do French fries. <laughs> <laughs> While these are toasting, do you want to try something else? Dragon fruit juice. You're just gonna chug it straight from the have bottle. To drink a lot of this, whether we like it or not. It smells sweet and spicy. Oh down, gosh! Down. The bottle squeezes and it splurts out the top. That's good. It's good. And it's all over our floor. Don't squeeze the bottle right after you open it. Done. It's done. Did it drip out the bottom? It didn't. The cheese isn't. Did it melt? Mm. No. I'm gonna microwave it for a minute. I'm gonna lose. <laughs> yeah, mine's looking perfect. So what? Mine's burnt and still frozen in the middle. So what? I'd like to know how perfectly colored mine is. It came and out crispy. Right. Okay. And yours is burnt. Okay, yours is melty. Mine is not melty in the Ooh. middle. I don't think I cooked mine enough yet. If I microwaved mine, I would have done that. Yours is good. Yeah. It's a tie. Mmm, they are good. Taco. How do you say it? Berea. Berea tacos. Berea. Going in. Going in the oven. 375 for five or six minutes. Okay. Not particularly appetizing looking. Your tacos are done. Oh. Really hot. Really hot. They're pretty good. Are they? What do you get that on the taco scale of tastiness? Four? Yeah. Four. Solid. Solid four. Like a hot pocket quality dinner. We almost forgot to try your vegetable cookies. Let's do it. Made with straight vegetables. Wanted to bring some attention to the ingredient list. Way at the bottom, we have vegetable extracts, which I think is different from whole vegetables. So what you're telling me is <laughs> these are just normal cookies with some drip drops of carrot extract in it? Yeah, yeah, maybe like the juice that drips down. So this is a marketing ploy and they're just selling good old fashioned cookies. They're good. Don't taste any vegetables. These taste like Chips Ahoy. They're better. The consensus is that these are just normal cookies marketed to look healthier than they actually are. They are not free though. We have a plethora of desserts. I'm gonna use the pronunciation guide. Taiyaki. Okay. 
Japanese fish shaped waffle cake with three sweet flavor fillings. Thank you, Japan. We have Portuguese custard tarts just traveling around the world here. Going back over to Europe, we have mango passion fruit. We don't even need to go to Epcot anymore. Fruit gelato. Alden's organic, organ made, dairy free, tropical twist ice cream bars. This is like a Dole Whip on a stick. Pineapple and coconut. That is Dole Whip. Together. That's Dole Whip. This doesn't belong in the freezer. It shouldn't be in here. Lacey's macadamia and milk chocolate. I have a confession to make. I've already tried cookies. one of those and they're so good. We're gonna make a reel of us trying all these desserts, so make sure you go catch that on Instagram or Facebook also or TikTok you. or YouTube. Just a short. Just post the same thing everywhere. Just bear with us. So go watch all four of them on all four different platforms. Oh, threads now too. No, do you post things to No, threads? just kidding, I don't post the threads. I don't think anyone does And that Twitter. Anymore. <laughs> hey, you busy? No.